song that nobody's ever heard before. Sick. So I hope you like it. Oh, my God. 
Reno, Broken Records again. We're at the finals of the uh, Ben Boozer Break Contest, Stone Pony again. I'm um, here with Until Holy. We spoke to them last time. We're going to have them introduce themselves again. Anthony Trino, I play the drums. Matt Herman, bass. Uh, Andrew Capalbo, I play guitar. Mike Drake, and I sing and scream. <laughs> so, uh, Why does everyone laugh when I say that? <laughs> Screaming is just an incorporation. Alright. <laughs> so, uh, we unfortunately came in literally at your last song, which uh, which was a new one, right? Uh, yes. Uh, what was it called? Because It doesn't have a real title uh, yet, but the working title is Dobby Killed the Tsar. <laughs> the fictional house elf from Harry Potter uh, murdered the leader of Russia in 1904. I'm totally kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that's actually... Fantastic! Is that We're like, all about the history. <laughs> yeah. But what, what is what is the actual um like where did that song come from since it's you know new? Um, <laughs> it came from like Michael Drake's room. Yeah. It did. It did. <laughs> um, I don't know. The music just just jamming. Like I like playing angry riffs, so angry riffs galore. And then uh, the lyrics are all about how everyone always says they don't care about you know what other people say about them. And hey, that's a good way to live your life. But if you got no one around you, that's gonna be uh. Be with you for the rest of your life. It's more important to have good people around you than anything in the world. It's really a song about my friends, Damn, about everyone who I love, deep. and everything. Yeah, <laughs> yeah especially Craig. Everyone who you love, Craig. Dobby killed whatever. Dobby right? killed the song. Yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> that's spelled C Z A R. Yeah, like yeah. like that's how it's spelled. Like Just making sure. I'm not yeah. Sure. yeah. Oh. This is an interview. Oh. We're not going to You're gonna be that guy. You're gonna be that guy forever. <laughs> anyway, so how did you guys feel? Because uh, th this is the final. So when do you guys find out about Mind if I take Monday it? at I think six? It. Take, take it. Take, take it. Take it. Take it. Uh, you know, before we had a lot of stronger shows. Uh, look, look, at you were look at me. Enter the question. Look at me. We had a lot more stronger shows today. I feel like was our weakest out of all three. Okay. Uh, but still, we're, we're confident. We're confident that you know we can we can make it. So we're excited. So what was and the question, the question you actually asked? Was, when do we find yeah, out when, if we get when, through? When, and that's when, Monday at 6. That was the question? Yeah. <laughs> you can find yeah, out Monday. Monday at 6. You're like, where, where do I look? <laughs> you can find out Monday at 6 on break, break a user website. Break the user. Com. The user. Okay. Okay. Or the the user. user. Yeah. Yeah. Respect the sponsor. Yeah. Best sponsor yeah. in the whole world. Yeah. <laughs>
I'm here with Lindsay Marie Bender, who uh, you guys are uh, here with Lindsay Marie Bender. And her guitar, so you want to introduce yourself? This is Brian Montoya. <laughs> so, that's my drummer. Oh, he doesn't oh. want to be in the video, though. No? Okay. That's Nick. Okay. <laughs> well, I, I originally thought that it was more of a band, but it's actually a solo. Uh, so, you want to. Yeah, what, what made you want to do solo rather than being a band? Well, see. It's, it started as a solo thing. I've been playing and doing like solo stuff since I was 16. And then I, when I came out with my CD in November 2011, it was like a full band CD. So I was like, I really want to get the full band sound that I performed. Okay. So then I found all these guys. Uh, well, what was the uh, CD called? Brand new. Brand new? Okay. Brand new. Okay. Brand new. Okay. Brand new. Okay. Cool. Um, you said Vineland your semifinals or Yeah, oh, that was our, the primaries and the semifinals were in Vineland. Okay, and now you're here at the Stone Pony. Yeah. Um, how, how did you feel about today's show? Because I, I unfortunately haven't, I haven't seen you, you know, perform other than uh, today. Was it like a show? Oh, I think we killed it. Yeah, no, well, I yeah. think, I totally think, well, no, because last time, the last show, I don't even know, I didn't think we were going to make it here because, because I, like, wasn't feeling well, he was sick, and, uh, wasn't our best show at all. I think it was probably one of like the worst we played. So then when they said we made it here, we're like, oh, we're gonna <laughs> get it. this is it. <laughs> Schwartz. I'm the poet Schwartz. I'll be performing all three days. I am part of the Bamboozle production team. That I love them, and I th and we love it because we get to hear <laughs> things, and it's awesome. So I'm with promotions, productions, a little bit of the artist development. I'm a, a part-time bar back when they let me, only out of respect. Right, Matt? <laughs> And Matt's part of artist Not development over. too. He gets a full vote. Say there are no rules, right? <laughs> if I'm part of artist development, I'm a barback. If Matt's a barback, he's part of artist development, right, neighbor? That's what it's all about. You don't want to get someone to bemoozle that only you would appreciate. You'd, you'd want again, like the judges and 
uh, it's it's done by uh, voting too, right? It's there are no rules. Yeah, it's, it's a little bit of everything. <laughs> mm, everything kind of contributes to who actually wins the uh, contest. Yes. So, right? Yeah, of course. Mm. But that I guess it's what we were talking about. Because mm. I don't know. I thought that was that might have been the <laughs> no, question no, just, we started with. No, no, just just a little bit of everything. I, yeah, I it's mean, a little bit of everything. <laughs> you know, just trying to find out. I mean, and maybe. if you don't. To not like things is more of a burden and more of a pressure than to open up and listen. Yeah, so you to, you have a right. defense mechanism, like, mm -hmm. well, why don't you? Mm -hmm. And then the rest <laughs> is like a nuanced discussion of arrangements, mathematics, and music itself. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe it's just not proper. That mm -hmm. comes in time. Maybe the vocals and the keys you're in aren't that mm -hmm. passively lined up, yeah. you know, maybe your bass player could open up the pocket more, you get into yeah. all these kind of musical sure. terms, so yeah, that's kind of evolve from it, you kind yeah. of grow with it, so. Yeah, not everybody plays, you know, you're at home playing grand piano all day, <laughs> yeah, all you know, you, know you have a clean sound, no, <laughs> and that's a, an age, it's a generational mm. thing, we're like, yeah, but I mean, you, you can, you know. You gotta be more open to everything, like me yes. personally, I, I listen to everything, but I like how the contest kind of brings out a whole bunch of different groups. We just had uh, Until Holy, they, they were more like metal, more like... Real metal! But now we have uh, Rachel Miller, who's kind of like kind of just a, a solo, which kind of, you know, plays Isn't an it... acoustic kind of, so she just kind of goes with that. Yeah, yeah. there's no rules, yeah, exactly. We just went from a heavy metal crunch to like, you know, a, a folk expression. Yeah, and you know, and I like how the contest brings that out. It's not just punk rock, it, it's not just you know, just metal. It's just every band is trying to make it uh, right now from all the genres. It's so. like everything, yeah, and that puts the audience or the people mm -hmm. to question themselves. And it kind of brings more people out because if you like more like folk, like uh, what Rachel's doing right now, you'll come out and then maybe you'll see Uncle Holy be like, that's actually pretty cool. Yeah. You know? Or you'll go take a break. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. so or overwhelming. But, but that's a lot of volume and, you know, just yeah. signal. Yeah. Like that. But that's fun. So I agree. Mm -hmm. And that's part of it. It's not one thing. Mm -hmm. And that's part of Bamboozle to make it all inclusive and to challenge the audience. Absolutely. Maybe step back. Open up. Enjoy things you've never experienced. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> so we thank you. Be well. Play your best. There's nothing wrong with knowing a little bit of fundamentals. You, you can study some of your parents' music. It won't hurt. It could be good, right? Yeah, definitely. The more you, you know, man. the more you can work with. So just let's all learn together. Right? How about that? Pretty good, right? Let's all learn together. All right, well, we're, uh, we're going to head in now and talk to more of the band. And I'll see you all the rest of the day. Bye, camera. I am awake. <laughs>